Summer in Chennai can be quite punishing. As the mercury rises and the sun soars high, so does thirst. Everyone looks for water to quench the thirst. Water, it's a critical resource for humanity. In fact, no life can exist without it. Not only does water give life, but every life is itself made up of water. In fact, 70% of the earth is made up of water. Water is of profound importance in Islam. It is considered a blessing from God that gives and sustains life and purifies humankind and the earth. Many verses in the Quran illustrates the value of water. Quran says, We made from water every living thing. Will they not then believe? And Allah has sent down the water from the sky and therewith gives life to the earth after its death. And we send down water from the sky according to due measure and we cause it to soak in the soil. And we certainly are able to drain it off with ease. Water is the most precious and valuable resource of the physical environment for all living things. The link between life and water is beautifully stated in several verses of the Holy Quran. And undoubtedly, all human beings rely on water for life and good. Propelled with the larger vision of service to society, one of the initiatives of Jamate Islame Hind Nungamakam unit is Project End Thirst. This project is a unique endeavor to provide safe, pure, mineral drinking water to the common man in the streets of Chennai, especially during peak summer months. Thankfully, during the simmering summer months of Chennai, many good NGOs and individuals come up with their effort to provide free drinking water to the public. But we wanted to go a step further. What about quality? What about hygienic environment? What about accessible location? Jamaat Islami Hind is a cater based national organization which works for the betterment of the citizens of this country in inculcating moral, ethical, spiritual and social values among the citizens of India. It works in different areas and has a number of frontal organizations which work towards establishing this objective. It gives special attention towards the social service activities. Every time there is a natural calamity, be it in the form of earthquake, landslides or a tsunami, Jamaat Islami has always been in the forefront to cater on humanitarian grounds to the common man and citizens of this country, irrespective of caste, creed, religion or culture. Whether it be social service activities at the macro level, like rehabilitation, health, education, microfinance, empowerment of the downtrodden and empowerment of women or at the micro level like this project which we have undertaken of providing pure hygienic mineral water to the citizens of this country. We have been working on the water project which has in fact been done for the past three years. We realize that especially for a city like Chennai, the need, especially during the summer time, was for water, good drinking water to the common man on the streets, irrespective of the caste, creed, religion, color. And when we started three years back, we started with uh, three locations. And Alhamdulillah, now in the third year, we have got ten locations. Uh, the response was very good and the figures were amazing. Each center, on a daily basis, uh, consumes almost three cans of 20 liters each per day. So after doing the entire calculation for two months, 
the figures were astounding for us and it turned out to be around 36,000 liters we have distributed during this summer period and the number of people who have benefited from it is an amazing figure of 1.2 lakh people. The Tamil Pandals installed at various parts of the city, we found something lacking in that, like the hygienic water and moreover, the people were reluctant to use the source which were put into. So we were wanting to improve on the subject. And at, at places we saw this uh, water sackets also being distributed, but we found it is a one day affair. So we thought we should work out on this. Henceforth was improvement on this. We thought of providing hygienic water to people of all walks of life, which would benefit everyone. In our team, we have volunteers who monitor the whole process at regular intervals and give the feedback every week. Now we are having these uh, bottles over here and, and we as far as possible we have tried to take the local people from the area to promote this whole scheme because uh, without the local support it is impossible to do a project of this kind. You know, this is not only about water, it is about bringing the community together, the people together and people from different walks of life, you see this area, it's a total new people from all, all kind of people, they work over here and a lot of people, a lot of movement is there in the streets and, and as the weather you can see, this is a typical Chennai weather in a, in a hot summer afternoon and the water is the only source of relief for them. Daily, we have supply of water daily. We have a lot of water daily. We have a lot of water daily. Really, we are all providing it is very good for the common people. I think that it is not hygienic or not pure. Especially with Chennai, it's a very good thing. We can do a lot of things. We can do a lot of things. We can do a lot of things. It's very good. It's very good. It's very good. It's very good. Water is of profound importance in Islam. It is considered a blessing from God. In fact, in Quran, paradise is described as gardens beneath which rivers flow. Clean and safe drinking water is a basic human need, a need that needs our efforts. Come, let's make a difference.